episode 2. It's a fascinating subject uh, to consider saying Let's King the legit 3D print farm or the best 3D print farm globally that I can find. I have in the past and still do claim to be the 3D print license king globally and I could sit here and talk about why I think that's the case and what is so exciting that I have that has uh, made me stand here and make it such a claim or I could talk about print farms and the challenge of legit 3D print farm 2022 is just to have someone claim that crown by just stepping forward to claim it and as the creator of such a challenge by way of me standing here and saying words and now extending them onto my circle here that I should easily be outperformed in this challenge which has not ended at this point because it was an external challenge that can anybody name or step forward as a legit 3D print farm and including the criteria that I had sort of danced around naming and laying out relating to license checking and paying legitimate royalties on uh, licensed 3D print and what that entails. And so the challenge still stands um, and I would I would personally love to stand here and say I crown so and so as the global 3D print farm king and I hope and look forward to somebody out there happily claiming such a title and I will stand here and clap for them and as I say my um, I don't feel like I've won this challenge because I stepped up and said I would do it if I were selling a print you know if someone walked in and bought a print I would do it legitimately so saying I would do it is different from someone else stepping up and saying of course but we do that or whatever their wording is and so that probably sums up episode two of this challenge so yeah I'll wrap it up there I wish everybody and nice success and be well